guys, Dr. Tracy Bennett here. I just want to give you a really quick clinical observation that might be helpful to you to help you protect your kids from a very common issue, which is cyberbullying. A lot of parents make the mistake of thinking that the victims of cyberbullying are usually vulnerable children, children with disabilities or children who have something going on with them. But one thing I've noticed over 20 years of practice is, although that does happen, you know, another common victim of cyberbullying are kids who are kind of on top of their game, kids who are the competition for the more predatory kids. So if you have a kid who's actually doing really well, maybe good in athletics or good in academics or particularly attractive or maybe outgoing, they are not immune for cyberbullying. Oftentimes, the self-selected kids in junior high, the kids who are purposely ambitious and trying to become popular will cyber bully the other kids who have high status in order to do better or to win. So unfortunately, that means no child is completely immune for cyberbullying, and I think you may benefit from my cyberbully guide below. So if you'd like to have some quick tips about how to protect your kids from cyberbullying and how to talk to them, please enter your email below and you will get my free cyberbully guide. And also, once a week, I'll send you a free article from Get Kids Internet Safe so that we can make the digital world a better place. So thank you for joining me. I'm Dr. Tracy Bennett. Enter your email below to learn what you should do if your child is cyberbullied and what you should encourage them to do.